Good day everyone. Today we are going to consider an important topic in economics titled Types and Functions of Economic System. Types and Functions of Economic System. If I may ask, what is economic system? Economic system can be defined as a means by which choices involving economic components are made in the society. You will believe with me that there is no economy or country in the world that have sufficiency in everything they needed. There is always an issue of scarcity, scarcity of resources, scarcity of economic goods, like lack of electricity, lack of adequate hospital, and so on and so forth. This means that for any economy or society to run efficiently or smoothly, they must be able to make certain basic economic choices or economic decisions for the smooth operation and progress of that economic system. This means that they are going to consider or give answer to basic economic questions like what to produce, how much to produce, how to produce it, for whom to produce. This leads us to a subtopic titled The Traditional Function of Economic System. The traditional function of economic system, or put mildly, function of economic system. One of the basic functions of economic system is that they must be able, the economic system must be able to decide what to produce, what to produce in the society or the economy amid the scarcity of resources they have. Also, another function of free economic system is that the economic system must be able to decide for whom to produce. As they consider for whom to produce, they also put into cognizance the production location for maximum demand and also low production costs. Another function of economic system is how to produce. How to produce involves the methodology they are going to apply in the production system of that economy. Are they going to use labor intensive method for the production process or are they going to apply cash intensive method in production process? The realization of the facts and components of these facts are the functions of economic system. Now, what are the types of economic system? We have various types of economic system, and namely one, traditional economic system, combined or socialist economic system, capitalist economic system and mixed economic system. We are going to consider these economic systems one after the other. First, the traditional economic system. The traditional economic system is a type of economy whose production and distribution system are governed by the tradition and belief system of the, that particular economy. This type of economic system exists mostly in the early stages of economic development, where there are economy, where the economy is strongly linked to the social structure. Unfortunately, traditional economic systems are often found in the less developed countries of the world. Another type of economic system is this combined or socialist economic system. Combined and socialist economic system revolve around only the own the government. There is collective ownership of factors of production, that is, the factors of production, that is, the land, the labor, capital, human resources, or even communication. Freedom of choice is freedom of choice in this type of economic system is very limited. The occupation of workers, the quantities type of commodity to produce and distribution of income are divided, are decided by the collective few for the government. Example of country that practice combined or socialist economies is Russia, North Korea and others. Another type of economic system is capitalist economic system. The capitalist economic system is based on private ownership and there is a freedom for individuals to practice their economic activity without interference, hindrances for governmental authority. Capitalist economic system is greatly associated with freedom of choice. 
governments do not leave or have excessive control over consumers, businesses, commodities, or even resources. The last economic system is mixed economic system, which is the combination of capitalist and command economic system. One basic feature of this economic system is that economic decisions in this system are taken by both the government and the private organization. So far, what have we considered? We have been able to establish a DC, the definition of economic system. Also, we have considered the functions of economic system, where we mentioned that they are what to produce, how to produce it, for whom to produce. Also, we have established the types of economic system, that they are traditional economic system, command or socialist economic system, capitalist economic system, and mixed economic system. But before I leave, I would like to give an assignment, which will be done, which I expect you to do before the next session of the class. One, what are the differences between capitalist and socialist economic system? Two, list 10 countries that practice missed economic system. This is the end of the class. Bye for now.